Last time when I was talking about generally speaking, uh, uh, I'm just trying to, uh, I'm having a duel with some people and in the duel we're trying to outfox one another and uh, well anyways it's a, okay we're going to move on. Let's see, now last time I said I would give you more talking about practical magic and I also wanted to talk about boxing and perhaps we want to talk a little bit about uh, uh, somebody wants to talk about uh, okay let, let's start off with uh, forget about that we're not gonna talk about all that stuff practical magic I don't know any magic uh, so practically none anyway so um, and uh, mm, uh, somebody want to talk about now we're not going to do as above so below again uh, we are going to mention that from time to time we get uh, interesting repronunciations of commonly seen words um, you know just to see if there's any other words in these words it's very difficult to give you an example uh, well we were looking at a French surname La Berge and uh, we found out that there's two spellings of La Berge L-E-B-E-R-G-E -E -E and L-A-B-E-R-G-E -E. and uh, we asked one guy from Quebec uh, you know what's the difference he said uh, well if uh, they were from France originally and they moved to the United States they used the La Barge spelling for La Berge and otherwise they might use the La Berge L-E-B does that sound right to me I don't know but it was one answer and then we asked what what did Berge mean B-E-R-G-E -E. and uh, we got the idea from this from the translation we were doing that it meant meadow